we begin, I want to introduce you to our guest star, Jojo the Chicken, who will be joining us in reading today. So let's begin. Little Joe Chickapig, a story about following your dreams. A chickapig is an animal hybrid that is half chicken and half pig. Little Joe Chickapig lived on a farm, a farm full of chickapigs and chickapig charm. For Little Joe Chickapig, still just a boy, the farm full of chickapigs brought him no joy. He dreamed of new places beyond the fields, sailing vast oceans with swords and with shields. He hoped he'd find courage to follow his heart, but how could he do it? How could he start? The Chickapig farm was all that he knew, with its crops and its fields and cows that went moo, and birds and bees and horses and goats. Why was he dreaming of castles and moats? Joe had an old grandpa, brave and bold, a Chickapig hero who broke the mold. Joe had an old grandpa, a sailor of seas, a Chickapig hero who lived so free. But how? How? How did he go? How did he do it? How did he know? To follow his heart against the tide? How did he do it? The young Chickapig cried. I'll tell you a tale, his mother said. I'll tell you a tale before I put you to bed. Grandpa back then, he was scared too. Grandpa back then did not know what to do. Grandpa had heard a story told of a great big bear who broke the mold. The bear was tired of striking fear, and all who saw him, all who came near. The bear had learned quite a skill to heal the sick and those struck ill. A doctor he became, my son, to heal the wounds of everyone. And those who used to run away now stood before him every day. The bear saw patients one by one. <laughs> Never again would anyone run. The bear became a friend, you see, to every creature beneath the trees. But how? How? How did he go? How did he do it? How did he know? To follow his heart against the tide? How did he do it? The young chickapig cried. The bear found courage from the strangest place. He heard of a mouse who went to space. The mouse she traveled to the moon and Mars. The mouse she traveled amongst the stars. Her ship it soared from Earth to space, but in that world she found her place. But how? How? How did she go? How did she do it? How did she know? To follow her heart against the tide? How did she do it? The young chickapig cried. The mouse, she heard a story told of a fierce young dragon, brave and bold. The dragon was known across the land. She gave up her kingdom to join a band. She sang her song, she strummed her guitar. Her music was heard both near and far. But how, how, how did she go? How did she do it? How did she know? To follow her heart against the tide? How did she do it? The young chickapig cried. There was a warrior from that land back before the dragon's band. He was a chickapig, just like you, filled with wonder and feeling blue. Tired of shields and swords to wield, he laid down his weapons and planted a field. The chickapig farm became all that he knew, with its crops and its fields and cows that went new, and birds and bees and horses and goats, and never a thought of castles or moats. Now, Joe, my child, I hope you will see, follow your dreams, whatever they be, and one day in the future, when you are old, your very own story just might be told. The end. Sweet dreams, little wildcats.